busy, busy shark there. Yes, she's going to need a bigger boat. <laughs> Or we could just sing the baby shark song, Jim. Oh, oh no, no. Way. Uh oh. I mean, I just say it and like it's automatically in your head, right? <laughs> it's true. It just has an effect on people. It, it does. Is. Yeah. Quite a negative effect. Word. Yes. <laughs> negative really effect. Awesome. <laughs> Thanks a lot, <laughs> Failinger. All right, here's a look at Storm Scan. Everybody's like cursing me now from the <laughs> for their cup of coffee. Okay. Storm Scan, not totally quiet at the moment. A couple of showers have hung on across the northernmost counties this morning, but these should not only just drift away, but also fizzle as they go. We're generally expecting the first half of the day to feature much more of what it did. Yes. Yesterday. Some sunshine. The dew points have climbed already, though. We still have a couple of clouds out there, certainly, but it's been a really pretty sunrise because of that for many of you. Just the way the light has been scattered. And look at this perfect example of it. I mean, you can literally see the beams uh, shining down here on eastern Philadelphia. So we're facing east from a broad and spring garden intersection here. Just really, really pretty view. And those clouds again can just scatter the light so prettily uh, when they that sun is rising or setting. So that's why it was such a just blazing red sunrise this morning. But I want to show you what's going on with future weather, too. So as of this point, I don't love how this initialized, but I do like the timing as it you know pertains to any showers that come through. It's very isolated stuff, guys, but you've got until at least lunchtime with any without any problems. Then after that point into the mid afternoon, a few scattered but locally drenching showers. There's that locally drenching again that starts to fire up for us again today, but it's very sparse by comparison to yesterday. It was a lot more widespread and certainly a stronger batch of showers and storms. This is some pretty drenching rain though that comes in later on tonight. And again, the, the placement of this could be a little different as uh, it actually ignites, but the timing again is the thing we're looking at here. Let me just jump it quickly to the seven. I want to give you a sense of when we finally break this stretch. Low 90s to mid 90s through Saturday. The worst of that humidity, though, takes a break by Sunday. Chandler?